everyone. Happy Saturday, everyone. So, uh, how are you, my soul tribe? Let's go. Um, let's ask like just some messages, messages from spirit guides, whatever, uh, whatever spirit guides wants to say to you about anything. Okay, love life, um, health wise, career, whatever spirit guides wants to tell you. And I dreamt about my grandmother, my late grandmother last night or actually early in the morning and she was like really like hugging me like we were laying down and she just hugged me and I'm kind of like like she doesn't want to let me go and and um feels like yeah I mean my soul tribe you know I originally wanted to to get guidance like message from your loved ones maybe we can tap in if there's any is anyone in your life that has passed on and and uh, is sending you out a message? I will find out. We will find out. We will ask the spirit guys, okay? So messages from your loved ones who already passed on or messages from spirit guys like or messages like whatever you need to hear right now. Let's go, okay? Uh, pile blue heart. Pile gold heart. Pile green heart. Pile purple heart. So feels like maybe... You know, nothing is ever a coincidence anymore because as a um, authentic divine feminine, authentic, uh, <laughs> however we say, authentic, genuine, awakened soul or um, divinely guided or supernatural or medium. Okay, let's go calling on my spirit guides, my guardian angel, the assistance of the higher power and the spirit of the universe as we're going to channel messages, possible energies, advice. For pale blue heart, gold heart, green heart, and purple heart spirit guides before kitty cats going to take a shower and run around again today. So uh, please guidance, please. And I love you, spirit guides, guardian angel, and uh, father up above, Jesus Christ, Mama Mary, and all the guardians, guardian angels, spirit helpers, spirit guides. Please help us if there's anyone that are our loved ones who already passed on who wants to... Um, send out a message to those who uh pick pile blue heart gold heart green heart purple heart you are welcome but only with the highest and the highest light and with the permission of the father and up up above and the higher power and mother universe we are calling the guidance of jesus christ as well so anyway <laughs> oh my goodness with the highest and, and the highest light because i just don't want to invite any spirits we have to like you know i shield myself with the white light the only the purest love and the purest light can go through and even spirits that have already passed on if they are not in the highest of vibration no okay so anyway let's go pile pile of uh, blue heart we will see you know I can just, uh, I can try my soul tribe. We are, uh, we are multitasking and I am trying. <laughs> okay, spirit guys, uh, channeled message please for whoever picked pile, pile of uh, blue because I was looking at the window and the colors of the leaves are already changing. So I'm not going to be picking up energies in my lap. Guardian angel in the table please so soul tribe can see thank you so much okay in the table please messages from their loved ones that already passed on or messages from from you spirit guys going to angel oh be careful of the dark attacks this is the devil energy be careful be wary of people places and things that's very who is very toxic that doesn't have the best intentions towards you always protect yourself so spirit guys says you need to surround yourself with white light, okay? Same thing when I was trying to ask guidance from spirit guys. So anyway, if you are connecting with someone, there's karmics, there's third parties, there's temptations, or simply be, if it's a general message, spirit guys says you have to uh, beware of the dark attacks or psychic attacks. You have to cleanse your energy and, um, you know, 
take care of you, okay? Learn to say no to temptations, to unhealthy habits, and healthy behavior. So this is the devil energy, okay? You need to cut away and move away from, from this uh, confusion, negative thinking. Possibly this is a, a message, okay, from the dark spirits that, yeah, you are nothing, you are not beautiful, you are not enough. So stop that. Spirit guy says you need to be confident. You need to vibrate to the light. You cannot plunge down uh, more deeper into the dark night of the soul and get stagnant there and nothing is happening in your life yes you need to in this is the world spirit guy says a change is coming in your life a beautiful change big happy changes surprises okay so i love that so i think if there's this is a message from your loved ones saying that like, like uh they are watching over you and um they're trying to say that that do not worry child because special changes or big surprises or or a change is coming in your life so that's how i understand but you have to uh you have to raise your vibration and be hopeful and the world is also new beginnings and fresh start although it wasn't easy let's say let's say okay you are connecting with someone see like there's a couple here like like they have the world on their shoulders. There was some challenges here, but Spirit Guy says it's time to open new cycle because the world is also new beginning. Okay, to open new chapter in your life, to release the past. Or maybe you are someone who is manifesting. You know, this is kind of like, I, I'm kind of torn in between. I want to say new beginning, but at the same time, it feels like, also second chances so this could be if you are someone who's manifesting new love it is possible but it's i am also picking up an energy that second chances okay so maybe it's a past life relationship so take whatever resonates with you because after all we are trying here but if there's any messages from up above yes nine of cups fairy godmother spirit guys or message from your loved ones from your higher self it's trying to say do not worry your wishes will come true okay wishes for true love for blessings for um wonderful career hopefully okay or good health because this is it like someone loves you maybe your um uh, messages from up above is trying to say could be like from this your deceased loved ones they're trying to tell you they love you very much and they're going to help you to make your dreams and wish come true although um nine of cups is also happiness okay like do not worry child change is about to happen in your life i know you're going through a hard time like nothing was happening in your life because you're going through this madness this chaos this stagnant energy choice yes and it's time for you to make a decision in your life dark night of the soul because this is the two of swords okay so uh the two of swords is also like someone is feeling confused someone is in a crossroad someone is stuck in the darkness that's why i was already trying to tell you that okay beware of the dark attacks beware of the bad dark forces the big bad wolf okay trying to pull you in the darkness and trying to tell you yeah you're nobody or if you are waiting for your twin flame union they're creating you know they're creating blockages or if these are tests or challenges the spirit guy says do not listen to the dark attacks you have to believe in yourself you have to believe in in love you have to believe in god you have to believe in your connection okay so spirit guys turn to say in order for your wishes and dreams to come true you have to get out of the dark night of the soul the tower moment the uncertainty okay because it feels like if you are connecting with someone who is like having blockages maybe you've been waiting for a while for this connection to happen and then there was a third party yes be strong spirit guide says there is change coming in your life and be strong and have courage and be kind because the universe has your back see it feels like and your connection is going to fight for you or if you are waiting for a job spirit guy says the divine and the universe is going to uh, guide you towards the right path towards the right career towards the right people to to support you when you are uh, when you are weak or if you feels like you're like like cast into stone there like not moving at all like nothing is happening in your life well look at this someone is holding the rope it feels like 
the universe trying to say we got you child so anyway um that's how i could understand sorry sometimes i do um repeat myself but if this is a message from the, your deceased loved ones we are here i am here guiding you okay we are watching over you i am watching over you please be strong and um you can get through this that's the message okay you are strong child you can get through this or you are strong so whoever i mean that's how i am i am hearing so anyway you you can you can get you anything that's the message okay so let's see pineapple yes i tell you reconciliation i already know this okay that's why even if i was wanting to say new beginning so it could be second chances reconciliation reunion twin flame union i already know that table hard work ahead well we already know that there's challenges and there's tests but spirit guide says to embrace the challenges but hard work will pay off okay so what else is very guys mool someone is extremely stubborn and unwilling to change okay so possibly that that's the reason why someone was in the crossroad because you were stuck there okay the the only thing that can get you stuck is if you are scared to embrace change so spirit guide says you have to uh, embrace change so you can move forward towards new beginning and make things happen in your life if this is all about love career i'm also sensing travel okay maybe someone's traveling towards you or maybe you're going to travel for work or maybe you're going to move to a new house new place a new job and then this is how you're going to make your wish and dreams come true although there's quite some uncertainty but it will lead you to the right path okay towards the right career your future spouse for your reconciliation see the pattern here i am just trying to to try to tap in the energy reconciliation for love okay for marriage or for for a job so um let me get one more please spirit guys can i have one more please just quick energy so if this is message from your loved ones oh there's months of the year october <laughs> we are october right now congratulations i don't i don't i don't pull this october a lot pile one so spirit guys let's take this time to release what you don't need anymore enjoy the holiday be careful but this is fall okay maybe your the message from your loved ones trying to say happy fall the colors are so beautiful and that's how you should be like just like the season of fall or autumn you have to uh change okay embrace change so you can um upgrade yourself acts forces working against you well we already know this you know that's the reason why your first energy is the dark attacks so but you know do not even be worried okay we already know that you're going through dark night of the soul tower moment you're going to struggle uh, in any you know in some aspects of your life but it's very guys trying to tell you if you have more faith in your heart there will be happiness waiting for you the future will be bright do not worry the door and opportunity is going to open in your life lily spiritual love you are in a twin flame connection possibility you are in separation or if you are together then your spiritual connection is very very strong you can energetically telepathically um, speak to each other and possibly at one point in your connection or possibly in your stages of your twin flame journey you're already dreaming about each other or someone is dreaming about you or you're dreaming about your twin flame love the lily is also like a mature love you know like um maybe you're connecting with someone older or mature or possibly this this process your twin flame journey has been taking forever okay so spirit guy says get out of this stagnant energy so you can you can um make things happen in your connection or maybe you were stuck with no job for so long no love no job or you're also not feeling well so spirit guy says ask help from others so you know it's time for you to um 
like vibrate or or ask from others but you know sometimes i do understand because if you don't have the wonderful circle of trust to ask for help then pray to god okay pray to guardian angels or ask spirit guides to to help you and i'm also praying for you my soul tribe for every one of us who are struggling right now so um dog barking but do not embrace dogs okay be careful so it's very guys trying to tell you like um at the same time you have to be guarded don't trust there don't uh be careful who you trust okay because that's how i am um i try okay i try pile one but this energy is very very strong so um i do believe that the message from your deceased loved ones they love you very much they're watching over you and be careful who you trust mature woman i already know this maybe you're the mature woman a late bloomer or you're connecting with someone who's mature but regardless as Perry guy says um or maybe you have to ask help from a mature woman from your mother from fairy godmother so anyway or from kitty cat but anyway spirit guys trying to say you're the empress okay possibly going through like moments in your life maybe you're not feeling well if not physically spiritually mentally or you're uncertain like what's what's to happen in your future remember remember spirit guys trying to tell you that you're going to embark on new beginnings in your life so can i have one more please thank you spirit guys yes i tell you travel energy this time to rise on you're going to free yourself from all these blockages that's holding you or imprisoning you from from your blessings okay so i do feel like you have to clear your karma or keep believing whatever oh my gosh sometimes it's hard to believe especially if if um you know you're experiencing dark attacks or blockages or hardship but spirit guys says have faith in your heart ask god for help you need divine intervention the moment we see dark energies here divine intervention okay so um let's let's get um oh my gosh the seer yes you're gifted future prospect decisions to make seeking guidance so spirit guys trying to tell you you're very intuitive so you have to align yourself to the divine so you can get proper divine guidance okay because you are very very gifted yes this is fairy godmother the high priestess the light priestess trying to tell you uh, embrace the light like uh beware of the dark attacks you can fight these dark attacks by embracing the god up above by calling divine inter intervention by by asking the white light to protect you and mother universe to to help you because wow it's saying here the light priestess galactic wisdom cosmic ritual so anyway you are a child of god and child of the universe okay you can channel channel messages you can get downloads or you you can get divine guidance so anyway um i don't know maybe you're clairvoyant clairaudient clairsentient so what is your gift you have the gift of seeing so uh we're just tapping on energy here or maybe your deceased loved ones is trying to tell you that maybe they passed on a gift a gift okay maybe you have a um this is loved ones is also very clairvoyant intuitive and then they're just trying to remind you that you have to tap in your god god's gift or god-given abilities okay to 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 guide you in your journey because you have every right to be here like i said you have a ch your child of god child of the universe because sometimes it feels like you don't belong but i know you are supernatural you are gifted soul so okay so spirit guys let's yeah be strong to 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 heal okay you are protected and the nine of cups energy your wishes and dreams will come true so oh my god i cannot stop spirit guys i just said i want i want 
Yes, Empress! I already knew this! Empress, you're waiting for your Emperor. You're a power manifester. You can power manifest your Twin Flame Union job or your healing or you can power manifest and, and make things happen to get out of these blockages. So let's go, okay? And you are protected because your spirit animal could be the dragon and Mother Universe trying to tell you they are supporting you or your deceased loved ones trying to say that they are guiding you okay to make your wish and dreams come true so i guess this is it for now because um i don't even know why i started reading now when i have to get out so anyway that's okay um let's go pile gold okay so messages from your loved ones this is loved ones or uh from spirit guides okay what is happening in your life messages please spirit guides for pile gold happiness this is the tree of cups okay so maybe you're wishing for marriage you're wishing for happiness to happen in your life maybe you're wishing for Oh my gosh, for the the old times, okay, when you can do anything without mask, without social distancing, but we are in the new normal now and we are meant, you are meant to evolve, okay? You are meant to embrace change. So Spirit Guys trying to say you will be happy, okay? So Three of Cups is, the key word here is happiness. So if that's a message from your deceased loved ones, they want you to be happy okay they want the best for you because what am i hearing yes this is the hierophant divine marriage it, so there's a message here that you will marry pile gold maybe it's like you know not not the the whirlwind romance that you are really praying for but it, this is divine marriage okay this is the divine guidance from up above is trying to tell you, yes, you will marry. Have patience, be strong, and uh, stay strong in your faith, okay? You're going to marry the, the love of your life, the man of your dreams, whose possibility, um, a leader, mature, or grown, okay? Not a person doesn't like drama. Maybe you're going to meet this person through a social event, okay? A gathering, a party, because this is a tree of cups, like a lot of people gathering, or a spiritual or religious community, like, or your, or, yeah, that's how I understand social event, or spiritual or religious community, or a cultural or creative event. <laughs> the moon in Paris. Okay, so spirit guys trying to say trust your intuition. You know you have divine guidance here. You need uh you you have the energy, very strong energy of the hierophant and the moon. That means you are guided towards your connection. Maybe you're in a twin flame connection. Maybe someone is trying to tell you I'm dreaming about you. I see you in my dreams. I can feel you. Or simply be spirit guide says, even if something you do not know, because the moon is also like uncertainty. You have to trust the higher forces. You have to trust God. Let go and let God. Okay, stay strong in your faith. I do think like that's the message for you, pile two. You gotta learn to trust your intuition and you gotta learn to believe and have faith, believe in magic, believe in miracle. And there's a lot that came here. So it feels like maybe if this is a message from your deceased loved ones, they're trying to tell you, child, you know, you have been very stubborn to not listen before. Or maybe whoever is your deceased loved ones, it could be anyone, okay? But it's a message that they know that, that you are, um, you know, could be stubborn, not listening. But this time around, it's trying to say that they are they are trying to ask God up above to help you. But at the same time, you have to have faith and you have to have, you need to welcome the, like the light and God in your, in your heart, mind, body and spirit. So you can win your battles here on the physical. So this is the Knight of Cups. Yes, you are manifesting new love. Okay, so Spirit Guide says you will marry the love of your life or you could be manifesting new love or help and support is coming in your life or this could be good news or someone is watching you, watching 
maybe it's like a secret admirer or someone is going to make a first move towards you this could also mean fated meeting but you know if in general spirit guide says your life will will go smoothly in the next few weeks because there is help and support coming in your life so i don't know whether it comes to career or or simply be like health wise you will be okay in the next few weeks nine inheritance nine of pentacles okay so but i'm seeing someone in here like feels like they're sweet they're getting married stability they're confident they love each other and they look in, they cannot take their eyes off each other so spirit guy says it's beautiful okay inheritance so that means maybe you know like i already tell you help and support is coming so there is happiness waiting for you or maybe your deceased loved one says inheritance may oh my god i hope they they left you some priceless treasure or if not then they tell they're trying to tell you do not worry because they are um they are like if you have a petition and a prayer they are helping your prayer to um if if this is a letter they are sending your letter and carrying your letter to god okay so god can 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 open it priority mail okay and and answer your prayer priority as well so i tell you this is the book of destiny this is mother universe trying to tell you i know it already you have the hierophant okay like the miracle worker and then you have mother universe trying to say child i am watching over you trust your intuition something unknown but but the universe is are here for you so cupidity this is the four of four of pentacles let, let go and let god let go of control issues okay because the spirit guy says you need to let everything flow sometimes maybe you want to manipulate you you want to um like my, someone is oh my god i don't know what to say but someone is watching you but i am hearing like so, you know sometimes you gotta stop pretending you have to be authentic if you're not well then you have to be honest that you are not well okay pile two and then you have to be honest in what you want so anyway maybe what's happening here spirit guys trying to say like oh my gosh maybe you're numbing yourself or at the same time you forget you forget to believe in magic you forget to believe in god so we can't do that okay so anyway or if you are someone already who has a strong faith then stay on it okay and let go and let god that's it because mother universe father up above is here okay with you file um file file two well if it's, this is a message from your loved ones i'm not going to pick this up october again it came again so anyway i don't know if i want to okay let's just so yes the like this is very guys trying to say this is uh, your really your message this october okay because when's the last time we ever getting this october energy so anyway let's just um get some guidance this is very guys for um for pale two woman empress dealings or relationship with a woman okay so wow maybe ask help ask help from mother universe or maybe this is a deceased loved one from your mother okay great grandmother trying to tell you you're a beautiful child oh my gosh you have to release the ex release the past it's time to move forward and the moon is here again i tell you changes is coming in your life see there's a repetition here so anyway i do feel like you have to check pile one and you are highly thought of someone is thinking about you someone is dreaming about you well we already know that but there's a message that changes is about to happen in your life and where's my acorn that's i mean my pine cone pine cones are also um intuition that also means protection so i'm going to get one more please so maybe you're also going to spiritual awakening but embrace the journey do not be scared if you are manifesting love spirit guide says there is love in your future 
okay broken wishbone wish will not be granted because it feels like what's happening in your life okay let go and let god there's karma that needs to be cleared that's the reason why the broken wishbone and you know your deceased loved ones and spirit guys knows this that's why now they're trying to tell you you have to let go of control issues stop manipulating this and if you're getting dark attacks well anyway you have to start believing because your your loved ones or spirit guys is trying to carry your your wishes directly to god priority mail okay that's how i'm trying to tell you already so do not worry okay because this is why your deceased loved ones or your spirit guys and guardian angel are stepping stepping up to fight for you fox shrewdness and resourcefulness especially in business okay so if you are a business owner or if you are someone manifesting career you're spirit guy says you're going to try because fox they're going to survive no matter what even in the most unlikely places and the hardest situ hardest situation they will thrive so the fox is also like maybe you know you are too sensitive you get too emotional spirit guy says when it comes to business you cannot be too emotional or maybe when it, this is about your personal relationship clear your energies Take a hold of yourself. Stop being emotional because sometimes when you're too emotional, you cannot uh, you cannot decide. Okay, the right decision if you're going to like you know be so high strong. So be stable. You can you can make deci decisions when you're stable. So possibly that's the message from your deceased loved ones or spirit guides toil and labor okay there's challenges ahead this is hands-on work it's time to get moving it's time to 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 do things action speaks louder than words okay so we know that okay it's it's not enough why your wishes were, weren't coming true because it's not just enough to to dream about it it's just not enough to be waiting on it you all have to believe in your dreams and you have to take action towards your dreams so there it is if you're manifesting for a job get out there start applying jobs and open your eyes to opportunity or if this is about a love life then spirit guide says open your heart to love okay and believe in love if true love oh my god or spirit guide says you have to ask divine guidance or if this is healing eat better sleep better do not stress <laughs> yes someone is coming in your life okay someone handsome someone beautiful so it feels like cinderella okay you could be late bloomer cinderella you're waiting for the one for a while and it feels like look look at the difference here she is like hard worker and then he is very luxurious so you could be opposite to each other but you complement each other and whatever the the differences they could be your your counterpart okay your future husband could be wealthy handsome creative and then here you are cinderella but anyway fairy godmother already trying to tell you they're going to make your wish come true even if you know there there was wishes and prayers that weren't answered before is because you forgot to believe the, the only way for you to manifest your dreams and wishes to come true you have to stay strong in your faith believe in god and believe in magic and ask mother universe to be with you yes and beware of the dark attacks this could be third party temptation okay maybe you are in a third party because the i tell you check pile one this is it okay courthouse okay someone needs to make a decision towards you so if you're connecting with the twin flame they need to see you okay because it feels like you are struggling there's separation there is chaos and conflict and then there's blockages here but until then there is a message here that your twin flame or your connection will choose you and i was just seeing three 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 two and one more second that was three 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 so anyway courthouse maybe you're having legal battles or spirit guys says be careful with this you know do not just sign anything without reading it so okay let's go let's i don't think i have time to be editing this sound but 
if i can maybe i will edit the sound if i have time today so it's okay spirit guys can i have uh two messages from their deceased loved ones or spirit guys open like the lotus flowering spirit revelation maturity so uh it's a message that you are learning from the life lessons you are a work in progress you are a flowering spirit you are an awakened soul because the the lotus is someone who who is like a, a, a symbol of independence of spiritual awakening of wealth and guidance that's why goddess lakshmi or goddess kuan yin or you know they are sitting on the lotus because it's a uh, it's a, a flower like very sacred okay so this is a message that that you are sacred or a message from your deceased loved ones to take start taking care of yourself okay you have you it's like believe believe that you're going to be happy do not put down yourself so much okay help yourself okay or or uh, they're trying to tell you that they are with you too helping you so do not feel like you're so alone tree of souls yes i knew it this is your ascended masters these are your um you know possibly your ancestors that you don't even met you haven't even met because they already passed on like long long time ago but they are still here with you trying to help you to clear your karma and that's the most beautiful of all collective wisdom kinship group library see these are your deceased relatives maybe this is loved ones that you know or that you know in this lifetime or already like your deceased ancestors from the past because it's kinship it's like someone you are related to who is already you know like walking in the like you know in the akashic book of records there up above trying to tell you that they're going to help you change your destiny if you are going through a very hard time so spirit guide says Yes, look at this. I mean, there is a lotus flower, the tree of souls. And I don't think we have seen this. This um, It's like, this is so beautiful. Okay, so let's just um, end your reading with a red card. I try pile two. But the message from your loved ones, do not just, do not give up so easily. They are here with you. Even your deceased relatives, deceased ancestors. Okay, it's kind of like Mulan energy, like, you know, your ancestors and then call the dragon to, to wake up your ancestors, okay? So you can bring honor to you and your family and at least to yourself so you can be happy and ground your connection or at least be stable. Good times ahead. This is the wheel of fortune. Good luck. Good luck. Good fortune is waiting for you. If you were like you know if your life was like nothing is happening this could be travel this could be happiness feast oh my goodness yes if the sun follow the light follow your heart follow your passion you will be guided this is marriage victory happiness success and divine guidance from up above after all you have mother universe and father up above this is the miracle miracle is going to happen in your life too oh my gosh maybe some message love yourself and then love and blessings and the light are going to pour in your life so anyway there is love and marriage good times ahead possible travel so someone's going to travel towards you fated meeting destiny actually this is destiny success or yes to your question and this is love and marriage so thank you pile two this is this is it for you for now or maybe a message from your um this is relatives that they are trying to help you to have your twin flame union or to to help you connect with the right connection so you are not just like you know waiting for nothing so you know pile two i like your energy you are very very much supported by your ancestors kinship group i've never seen that before so thank you pile green what is the message for you pile green message from your deceased loved ones ancestors or a uh, message from spirit guys so pile green <laughs> oh my god no okay i thought it was like okay so someone is wearing a mask here something is lacking in your life 
maybe love department okay maybe you don't have a job you don't have a love life because the keyword here is boredom and i'm so sorry because i didn't know i thought someone is is giving you flowers or something but it feels like yeah something is not right possibly you were connecting with the wrong connection or if you were connecting with the right connection there's some distance there's some blockages okay because it feels like nothing was happening in your relationship but you know you know that the connection is there but what is the blockage why you cannot make this why your your uh your connection is having a hard time so what is happening nostalgia so this is a past life relationship because there's karma that needs to be cleared the good thing is there is a message that you are my past my present and my future so whatever happened i do think that um there was some negative karmic drama negative karmic pattern that needs to uh to be cleaned up okay this could be a divine masculine because for some reason in your pile there's someone okay wearing a mask like right here the lady is wearing the mask and then now it's the man wearing a mask i've never seen like it okay so what is very guys trying to say you both need to work on your connection do not trigger each other because right now you're both wearing the mask but regardless this is a past life relationship six of cups is like you know you know there is a connection here so you're possibly getting uh or seeking knowledge from the past so what am i yes karmic third party temptation okay or if there's no third party temptation then you're going you're getting dark attacks confusion like like the madness like why okay nothing is happening well this is it okay because you were both trying to clear the karma but then the temptation came in here and 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 try to whisper try to whisper confusion possibly you know because the dark forces doesn't want you to be together okay so spirit guy says you have to believe okay that you can you can fight this okay so i know the journey wow what is this queen of wands be a warrior be strong you're creative you're beautiful so possibly spirit guys just you um you forgot your self-esteem okay maybe you're go you're suffering right now with low self-confidence and low self-esteem but your counterpart is truly dreaming about you so anyway it feels like you slightly recognize each other but then the dark forces came in here and then put more blockages in your path but remember spirit guys says someone has to fight here and this is a feminine this is the queen of wands believe in yourself take action towards your goals or possibly you're connecting with someone creative so Oh, wow emperor yes <laughs> you are connecting with your emperor so divine feminine you have to fight for your divine masculine but it's a good news okay because your divine masculine is also going to fight for you no matter how hard the journey this is the emperor okay they see you so yes ace of swords wow there's a shaky beginning there's a lot of journey here but spirit guy says there's going to be new door new opportunity victory and success and the truth okay there's a painful awakening painful realization but regardless this is like fighting the battle and winning it okay so this also means like maybe you're going to struggle right now bad health or maybe like shaky shaky moment in your life like you're so uncertain what to do but it's very guys trying to say there is victory and success in your future success in love success in good health success in marriage and connecting with the true connection your emperor who also needs to fight for you who who will see you who will understand you who will offer you stability protection so anyway i am seeing like an energy of a job okay that is a high paying position or like or maybe you are someone who is contemplating or working on a project okay then spirit guy says keep learning because i am seeing stability in love and career as well but you have to have confidence so anyway that's how i understand in your journey this is this is 
Well, well, I mean, yeah, there's there's some challenges here. So anyway, let me just move forward and ooh, one second, spirit guys. Sorry, we're all over the place because when I'm channeling like this. So what's the message from your loved one? Be a warrior. Okay, you were hurt in the past, but the spirit guy says it's time for you to love or your your um from your deceased loved ones love again. It's time for you to heal and you are ready to love again. Okay, you're you it's like you deserve to to be with the love of your life. Okay, you cannot just like maybe if someone is stuck with a karmic connection and then but you also went through your awakening, so you kind of knew that the that the connection wasn't there. So anyway, whatever the the message is, Spirit Guy says it's time for you to fight for the real connection. It's time for you to fight for true love, or it's time for you to fight for your own heart. Okay, because you've been hurt before, and but now Spirit Guy says you will heal, or your deceased loved ones tell you they're going to help you heal. Or they, they saw you, okay, crying when your heart was broken and is bleeding. But anyway, the good news is you are going to rise above all this pain, okay, and and open a new door. So all these things that happen in your life, Pal Green, the pain, the struggle, just take the life lessons of it, okay? That's okay, because it's going to lead you towards um better opportunities better person heart i tell you i already knew that how i've been saying i've been speaking about heart and then here comes spirit guides love deep affection and caring it's time for you to love again there is love coming in your life or true love and blessings is heading your way soon there you go heart is love and marriage tongue card celebration fun enjoyment see spirit guy says you will move towards happiness and celebration is also like maybe you're going to meet your future spouse through a gathering or celebration or celebration is also marriage your marriage your wedding you're going to marry for true love okay so that's good i love it this is love, happiness, and marriage. And pale green, look, I mean, it's very guys trying to say, you were confused before because you were wearing the mask. Dogs, getting together with friends. Okay, so um, surround yourself with good friends. Okay, or ask guidance from spirit guides and guardian angel, but be careful who you trust, okay? Because <laughs> sometimes the more the merrier, but sometimes too, the more the drama. So, you know, you still have to like have your sanity with you. So it's good to have friends, but remember, Pile Green, you have a very important lesson. It could be a message from your deceased relatives or, um, from spirit guides that you know who are with you in your like you know when you when you see these people around you in your lowest moment when you are weak when you are low when you have nothing they do not turn their back on you that's when you know who your tr true friends are but if you know that some people okay if, if they are if they see you so weak and needing help okay or or oh, that's how i understand okay it, it means like be careful who you surround with because not everyone has the best intention towards you and you know who your friends are you know there's a song here that they are with you even when you're lowest or even if, when you're up they are there with you they never change but some people will just be there for you when you are high okay so that's a good lesson and i like it because i, I picked pile green november so by november that's officially next month beautiful changes is happening in your life okay maybe get ready for winter take care of your needs and um get ready for beautiful things to happen in your life so anyway spirit guys trying to say um there is happiness and love i tell you the rose would you accept this rose <laughs> romance is in the air well we already knew this okay because there is heart <laughs> there is rose maybe there is new love 
new love prospect or someone coming in your life already watching you okay but anyway i am seeing love happiness getting together with good friends and vine seek out information that will help you okay and divine guidance okay someone is trying to find out things about you because this could also be the tree of pentacles energy the community which the dogs energy getting together with friends is also community spiritual religious community family or friends so um if you are surrounded with toxic people well be careful that's the reason why seek out information that will help you or if this is you trying to get divine guidance what you need to do well spirit guys trying to say you gotta know what you want okay if you're manifesting if you're praying for something if you're wishing for someone or something or wonderful things to come in your life make sure make sure uh, that you are you will um you are clear and precise on what you want in your life okay so your wishes and your prayers will will be much more heard from up above i mean they already know what's in your heart anyway but it's still good to be specific on what you want okay with your wishes and your dreams and anyway message from your deceased loved ones that's it something about the community maybe it's, they're trying to tell you it's okay to be alone it's okay when you are trying to heal it's okay when you don't want to be speaking to others about what your deal is because like i said not everyone has the best intentions towards you some would be there for drama but some would be there to really support you so it's up to you to know who is with you who are who are with you and not with you because you can't be like that okay you cannot be you, if others do that to you like just be there when you are okay and then when you are needing help they run away from you it's kind of like my channel <laughs> that reminds me okay i mean that's the reality here okay it feels like when you are okay everyone here and then when your kitty cat is asking help everybody running around i mean that's true because that big pile green okay so thought someone is thinking about you or you're connecting with someone very very creative okay so this is a masculine energy thinking about a woman or you are a woman thinking about someone but there is some slight temptation blockages right now be careful of the dark attack be careful of like these blockages and temptation that is hindering your connection main female be the empress it's time for you to step into your power as the empress and power manifest what you want in your life it's time for you to make a decision what you want okay i already tell you that okay be specific on your wishes and your dreams and you know you have the rose here and you know for some reason you also have the rose there is a specific message maybe you have to like look what the spiritual meaning of the rose but i know this the red rose stands for love passion and and uh happiness or this could also mean marriage okay true love is coming your way or this could be secret admirer or new love or you're going to win over this temptation okay roses could also mean money also mean career stability and abundance so anyway um wow i love that empress we have the rose we have the heart so thank you Do we, did we even have the emperor too did we have the emperor yes we have the emperor pile three and kitty cat was kind of like kitty catting in here so anyway let's go um so message from your deceased loved ones and spirit guys you will be stable you will be happy you your your prayers will be heard that's it okay the tree of illumination wow truth revelation understanding well we already was channeling that it's time to make a decision on what you want be specific with your wishes and dreams but you are heard your prayers will be heard and the tree of illumination is you have to walk towards the light maybe you are uh, questioning you have so much question inside yourself where do you go from here you're special okay the tree of illumination is you are touched by the light or you need to um welcome the light in your mind body and spirit because this is mother universe trying to tell you 
this is this is them the divine guidance to make you understand and to make you remember who you are what you are what's your life purpose what's your life mission so in order for you to power manifest i mean this already emperor and empress energy here okay divinely guided from up above so what now water spirit cleanse your energy let your emotions flow go with the flow and that's it like the water energy emotions memory life force and wash away the cares the concerns okay what can you learn from the energy of the water cleansing new life new cycle new beginning okay it's kind of like the mermaid energy like um cleanse what you don't need but then the water is also like a, a force to be reckoned with like wow i i do believe that it's like waters like you are trying to ask shower of blessings in your life and also help water wash away all the struggles the pain the dark attacks the psychic attacks okay so should i take this spirit guys i'm uh, sorry spirit guys i wasn't paying attention i wasn't even looking so can i have three energy please for pile of three thank you spirit guys prosperity good times ahead okay prosperity peaceful times ahead peaceful resolution or forgive yourself forgive others or this is like walk the path okay there is abundance but you have to walk the path that's that's how prosperity means could also mean abundance freedom yes free yourself from all these blockages or freedom because there will be like a relief from all this this uh stress that you've been going through right now the struggle yes the challenges rise above the challenges that's the reason why spirit guy says you went through so much shaky beginning you are so uncertain you're you're wearing the mask and you're connecting with someone who was also wearing the mask and then there was there was some challenges in the journey. We already know that. But the freedom could also mean travel energy. Or prosperity also means, yes, you can ground this connection. Kitty. And clear the karma. Life purpose. Life mission. Win the favor of the higher power. But what this karma means, you have to let everything flow. Okay? Money, energy. Or you have to... Um, how are you going to win this connection? How can you win over these challenges? By creating good karma in your life. Okay? Like, um, do not do to others what you don't want others to do to you. So, be the bigger person. If, um, like I said, my soul tribe, you know, do not let money and fame and fortune, like, change you. Okay? Like, you know, others could be, like let's say they are on the top and then they forgot okay they forgot where they come from or maybe they forgot the other ones who really need help so we can't be like that either we're going to be high low up and down we need to be the same same way like me my soul tribe when i'm asking you for help like do not run away from me okay because there will you know i am a take action person i'm not going to be unstable all the time and but the same time too i will remember what you do for me because when you are here with me especially as my soul sister soul family soul tribe I will remember it. And that's the reason why I am here right now pushing myself, whether I am busy, whether, you know, I don't think, uh, you know, whether this is mind over matter. But since I, you know, it's the same way as my day to day, I should have just run out. But I, I told the spirit guys, that's okay, spirit guys. I know someone wants to hear this message and I'm going to push myself because if I did not see any soul family, any soul sisters who cared about me when I was in my weakest moment, I would have done this, my soul tribe. I wouldn't even look back. Okay. But anyway, spirit guys wanted to say we need, we need to be, um, uh, be better versions of ourselves we cannot be like angry and grudges and and stuff like remember the good you do will always come back to you but but for some reason stop expecting good things whenever you you do good deeds okay let the universe let god judge judge what blessings come to to your life and stop expecting blessings because that that ruins the purpose of of like good karma okay anyway but that's just the thought okay like um you need to create good karma in your life after all whatever the blockages the challenges here in the journey 
there is happiness waiting for you there is love there's marriage there you have the heart you have the rose this is the yes powerful yes to your question the divine guidance of the universe and and uh protection okay and ward away all these dark spirits finding the light or the light shining in your darkness okay light in the darkness my soul tries like guardian angels and spirit guys or your deceased relatives spirit helpers like opening like the 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 door okay so you're not going to be like alone there in the darkness or this is the universe going to um allow your spirit helpers your ancestors to look over you to watch over you because there's a message here from your um from your deceased relatives that they are trying to protect you but they needing the the permission of the miracle worker the father up above to be with you okay because the you know high spirits or high vibrational spirits work like that okay they all we all have to vibrate to the higher power so um but you are protected regardless but the spirit guy says but first you have to prove yourself that are you really worthy for this gift? Are you really worthy to to get help? Are you someone who's trying to heal to heal your karma? Are you someone who is a good person? Because if the answer, if the answer, if the divine knows that you are trying to be a good person, to walk your life purpose, to to be a better version of yourself, okay? That you are there for keeps on your journey. Oh my goodness. And then all these evil eyes, this fairy guy says, is going to not touch you, okay? And let the trolls, the haters be gone, okay? All the dark attacks, they're not going to touch you. So anyway, um, that's a very beautiful message for you, Pile Green. And be a good friend, okay? Be a good soul sister soul brother be a good soul family you can't just be with someone when they are high and do not be running when they when someone cannot offer you something because that's going to come back to you okay that's how the karma is so anyway uh pile four let's go what it, where is pile four you know sometimes it's tough love my soul tribe things that you don't want to hear but kitty cat is here you know remember i'm also being taught by spirit guides and we can't do that to ourselves because it's going to come back and it, remember i'm already like guided by spirit guides here the words is going to come out whether we want we want to hear it or not because remember we are here asking for guidance and we have to you know, we want the truth. And so this is it. It's very guys trying to say, we need to be better for each other. We need to be, uh, we need to clear our karma anyway. So anyway, let's go pile purple for whoever picks pile purple. Let's go spirit guys. What is the message for pile purple, please? Message from deceased loved ones or message from spirit guys positive effort this is the ten of wands let go of stress you need to think positive okay because you are feeling hopeless or maybe you're feeling uh, like like burden or the stress you need to eat healthy eat better and uh, breathe peace maybe you need to take breathing exercises because spirit guy says release the stress inhale peace release the stress because Possibly you're thinking, where is your connection? Or if you're, if you are with someone and there's chaos and the, the conflict or whatever the deal is, there is stress, there is chaos, misunderstanding, conflict. Okay. Or maybe you're stressed about work or you're connecting with someone who are stressed about their job as well. But this is the will of fortune. There's changes coming in your life. So anyway, I'm not sure if this is a yeah i think this is the wheel of fortune okay so let's just see it feels like the world the wheel of fortune but this is tan so this also means new cycle changes is about to happen in your life do not get stressed your life will get better if this is all about your question is all about love well someone is hugging there they're like going on a date <laughs> fated meeting or possibly like true love yes look at this you can like the chemistry you love each other very much spirit guy says you know um oh 
my gosh you deserve love someone is going to love you someone is waiting to love you someone is going to hold you okay and i hope that your feeling for each other is mutual you're not just going to be with someone okay just because you don't want to be alone anyway spirit guys says there's changes new cycle 10 10 10 stability protection someone to go home to someone to be happy with yes page of cups this could be new love okay spirit guys trying to tell you this is new love oh my god i'm checking my phone because i kitty can't need to go now so anyway secret admirer new love someone sweeping you off your feet someone who's going to offer you stability so this could also be blessings this could be new job new love new beginning new cycle queen of wands believe in yourself you this is kind of like cinderella okay anything is possible if you wish them to be true if you believe in yourself that that you deserve to be happy you are going to fight for yourself for your connection you're going to fight for your goals and you know the queen of wands is also the energy of creativity talented beautiful make over your life <laughs> or keep up with your beauty and simply be do not give up on yourself or do not give up on love because someone is about someone special is about to come in your life yes there you go ace of cups union marriage intuition and also this is also like self-love, okay? When you love yourself, when the love is overflowing, and then eventually, that's how you're going to attract in your life true love and blessings, okay? And high vibration and peace. So, pile four, congratulations. This is the most beautiful so far, okay? Spirit guide says love and blessings is going to overflow in your life, Emperor true love you're going to marry your emperor so it feels like if this is a twin flame connection yes you're going to have your twin flame union from the very beginning you're just feeling stressed and confused but spirit guy says your twin flame loves you very much you can make this happen fated meeting to to make this happen okay to meet each other to be together believe in the connection because you are beautiful or they think they're you are beautiful the connection so unbelievable spiritual connection physical connection and yes he's going to to um your connection is going to give you stability so you could be connecting with someone wealthy or someone is stable for you someone who understands you someone who thinks you're beautiful with or without makeup someone who truly gets you okay so that's a beautiful message from spirit guys pile four i'm so excited so this is also a message from your deceased loved ones that there's a lot for you to be excited about look at the energy here and there's already a star okay so um it feels like your your deceased relatives or your ancestors never met trying to tell you they are with you okay and they're possibly think, trying to tell you that maybe you are praying you're meditating and you're doing something right so keep keep doing it and let go of the stress okay even though uh, there's pain but it feels like they're spirit guides and the divine is trying to say like you kept the faith in your heart so congratulations pile purple you must be doing something right or if not then at least keep believing okay because there's love, there's stability, there's new love, there's fated meeting, there's possibly new job as well, bridge, there's passage, there's communication, successfully overcoming a problem. Well, there is, this is a message from your, this is loved ones, you can overcome this problem you can rise above these challenges congratulations nothing that we didn't know may something about spring everything will get better by spring by may or whatever it's like changes there is the the uh, there's a lot of things to look forward to okay because this is the cherry blossoms i love the cherry blossoms and the bridge could also mean travel energy or someone if you are in a distance with a love connection, maybe it's like, like I said already, we know someone's traveling towards you, making things happen, like getting together, coming together, 
okay unsuccessful outcome to a problem okay so there is a bridge and there is a broken bridge so spirit guys or your deceased relatives trying to say you have to uh be careful with your decisions okay you always have to vibrate to love in order for for successful outcome to your problem you have to get divine guidance divine intervention you have to vibrate to love you have to vibrate to god so this is a warning from from your deceased relatives that there are um forces that's beyond our control, okay? Like, I know we want to be happy, but at the same time, you have to ask protection because remember, if the light is strong, and so is the dark forces, so fan, romance, celebration, party. So you're going to meet this person to a celebration, a party, or the spirit guy says love is in the air romance is in the air or there is wedding in the future or you're going to marry your emperor your empress change is coming so anyway spirit guy says maybe you went to maybe like i don't know what to say spirit guy's trying to tell you like maybe there's going to be some setbacks okay around me or around like just in case next year there's going to be some setbacks there's going to be challenges well nothing new already my soul tribe every day we wake up there's always trials and setback anyway but this is a message from from your uh deceased loved ones or spirit guides that whatever the setback whatever the blockages the hardship you will conquer okay you will be victorious because there is romance there is celebration there is party that means happiness okay or wedding so wow and maybe it's very soon you have a lot of month coming it's like beginning with um there is may and there is march so may is springtime and march is what is winter spring yeah something like about well february is like something about spring so anyway march april may this is like springtime my soul tribe okay so really spirit guys truly trying to tell you and i was just seeing 1 11 22 now something about spring okay so anyway just like springtime you bloom okay like a flower but even if they're set back the flowers is going to bloom anyway <laughs> or if you're going to ask guidance from up above to let to let you grow like the flower and bloom yes you will because they are the miracle worker god is your miracle worker pain new job career i already told you that okay so uh maybe spirit guide says like you're going to setback okay from from um looking for a job or like if you're trying to manifest your connection or if you are waiting for someone to express their love to you so anyway spirit guide says beautiful things will happen by next year okay by march or by uh may whether this is beautiful things happening or my some slight setbacks there's nothing to fear okay spirit guys wanted to let you know or your deceased relatives trying to tell you you are guided and i saw a fair man i don't know if if that was it but anyway it's a masculine energy so anyway uh can i have one rose i tell you romance is in the air i already saw it and i tell you my soul tribe fair man Damn. i did not took it because i wasn't sure because it fell in my lap and then it came out again so maybe spirit guys trying to say fair man this could be guardian angel or this, maybe you are connecting with a fair-skinned person okay so or if you are not resonating with a fair-skinned person then this is some energy of a masculine okay so um dealings or relationship with a man with blonde gray or white hair okay or this could be you have to ask guidance from your father or someone someone close to you or a friend that is a uh, light light skinned or someone with gray or blonde hair or light hair anyway we already know that so anyway
Oh my goodness. We try. I need to finish this reading spirit, guys, because I don't know what time is it now. What is happening? Yes, travel, distant horizon. I have to pick that up. But you're going to free yourself from all these blockages. Eventually, you're going through stability. Stability in love, success, career, healing, mature woman. So you could be a late bloomer. Or spirit guys says learn from the pain. Okay, even though you're kind of like a late bloomer, but spirit guys says you will bloom. That's why I was already seeing just like a rose. You're going to bloom. There's like a song by Seal. I forgot like it's the rose, but I don't know what the message, but I'm channeling that right now. <laughs> oh my goodness, you are connecting with someone wealthy. Well, we already know this. A wealthy man, but a man who has going to change us right now but we already is emperor already here yes emperor is already here with you nothing that we didn't already know you're connecting with a wealthy man creative person possibly entrepreneur who's going to travel towards you and maybe you are there waiting for a long time okay but you're already grown so let's say let's say uh you are a feminine you're not necessarily like a mature woman but you are young in spirit or if you are still young the spirit guide says maybe you are an old soul you already embrace the journey and so you are waiting for the one to come in your life and offer stability well we already knew that spirit guides or spirit guides trying to say you are going to find stability when it comes to money or love okay and freedom you're going to be like 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 you know like mel gibson and the brave heart okay freedom healing the earth love humility respect okay love yourself respect yourself and be humble okay because this these qualities is going to help you in your journey okay this is going to be the the character and the attributes that's going to manifest blessings in your life. Be loving, be humble, be respectful, be trustworthy. Okay? So, um, or this is also like, possibly you're an energy healer. This is your life mission. Okay? To spread love, light, positivity to the world. And at the same time, you're also learning your life purpose, life mission. At the same time, you're also manifesting your twin flame union. <laughs> your emperor. Your true love in your life. The high priestess, fairy godmother trying to tell you you are special child. You are child of God, child of the universe. So galactic wisdom, cosmic rituals, something like an old soul. You're someone who is an old soul. Okay, possibly a star seed, possibly an earth angel and what is your key to manifest your blessings in your life the light okay high vibration you have ace of cups as well so you need the light and the love after all this is also love so you can heal the frequency of the planet you can heal the earth you can heal yourself you can heal your connection so this is like a message for you pile four or a message from your deceased loved ones that um wow maybe your ancestors Maybe you have an ancestors you've never met who are energy healers, okay? Or this is your, um, wow, you could be a light worker as well. So anyway, it's your deceased relatives or spirit guys is trying to tell you, keep walking the path. You are going to move towards better times. And there's kind of like purplish energy here. So you are a healer, okay? And it's good to know. Maybe you already know that from the start anyway. Or you are an earth angel or a light worker. Like here for a mission. Yes, twin flame union. Bam! Reunion. There you go. Thank you so much, spirit guys. This is love. This is marriage. And we already know that you are in a twin flame journey, a past life relationship, and someone you're connecting with someone stable, someone who's going to choose you, someone who's going to fight for you. Okay, so thank you so much. <laughs> And spirit guys is going to guide you. And this could be your deceased relatives as well. Trying to lead you towards the right path. We are here with you. That's the message to guide you towards your destiny. And it's the most beautiful message of all. Do not worry. Because your ancestors or your deceased loved ones or relatives. 
if they already pass on and already in heaven they are watching over you okay trying to help you clear the karma so you can ground your connection with your twin flame or your future spouse and to to um direct you towards your destiny so you can go the distance and going to be successful when it comes to job your life purpose and your love life okay so you can be married in this lifetime happily because i do know that you're going to marry for true love pile four i have no doubt about it so spirit guy says you just need to walk the right path and i like that because you have the bridge and you have the broken bridge the the same time so maybe spirit guy says maybe nothing was happening or there was some slight setback but whatever's going to to happen you are guided you are meant to be strong or you need to be strong or you have to be someone it's like the message never fear the fearless because um no matter what happens the spirit guys or your relatives or the divine and mother universe trying to, to say you are you are not alone okay 777 you are on the right path and destiny is also like good fortune great fortune whatever you want in your life is going to come true okay so make a wish and please make your wishes and your prayers for the highest good of all if that is your wish to bring down others i don't think that's going to uh you know work because we don't wish bad things on other people no ill wishes no bad juju no nothing okay so spirit guy says for the good of all okay for the good of your relationship for for yourself okay be better version of you so congratulations pile four but it feels like your your uh deceased loved ones wants to say they love you very much they have been watching you and never they never really left your side so also a message that possibly you're a scary cat okay maybe they're trying to reach out to you in your dreams or um or maybe you you felt like a slight breeze or you see a feather or a coin and um, sometimes you ignore it okay but this is them so maybe now you're paying attention to your dream or a feather or a coin or something okay or maybe like you're walk i don't know what to say maybe you hear like a special song or something or maybe you you smell like a whiff of fragrance that you know it's from your deceased loved ones i don't know they're trying to tell you do not be scared okay but keep saying your prayers and keep vibrating to the light remember you are a child of god a child of love and light so thank you so much and you deserve the best you deserve love and happiness in your life okay and you are protected and guided and supported thank you very much have a good day happy weekend bye